Welcome to part six. Today we're gonna make a shop, or more specifically, a shopkeeper. Very quick, just make some person. Here you go. Um, say merchant. All right, so when you walk up to them, and they're fixed, so they're not gonna move, that's all you have to do is just make the graphic. Walk up to them, and on the third page, shop processing. And then if you double click, you've got your list of items, weapons, armor, everything. So let's say you want them to have a potion, which is already in here. There you go. Potion, 100. And this checkbox uh, purchase only means you can't sell things to this merchant. You can only buy them, but we'll just leave that alone. Now, let's say there's an item here that's not something you want or you want to add your own. No problem. So let's go up to the database. We're gonna to go to items, and um, let's change magic water to, I don't know, poop juice. This juice will help you poop. Okay, so here's the thing to know. There's regular item and key item. I don't know what hidden, hidden items are, but uh, key item means exactly what you think it's used for something it can't be used in battle it's very specific i just leave things at, at, as regular items uh 300 let's set it to five and consumable yes if it's not consumable means you can use it over and over again which works for some enemies or i'm sorry some items occasion now always means you can use it in battle you can use it on the map um, we don't want that for everything like a potion for example you want to use that everywhere uh, some things you only want for the battle screen like uh, let's say a fire element potion or something and then the menu screen is something you can only use outside of battle and then there's never just in case you want to have an item you can never use for whatever reason usually key items so let's say menu screen um, and then here's the effects which this can do all sorts of things but uh, let's delete recover MP so if you double click you've got recover add or remove states and states are like poison paralyzed that kind of thing and then uh, buffs and debuffs this is also for battle you know like berserked or whatever special effect grow Grow is really good if you want to level up outside of battle. Like you could say like attack five. So your attack will go up permanently by five, which is cool. You can also have like books that teach you skills. So there's a lot you can do there. Um, for now, we're just making items. It doesn't need to actually do anything. So we're just gonna, we're gonna sell some poop juice. So again, double click on the merchant, go back to the merchandise, double click and poop juice there we go all right um now if you do this the shop will just immediately open so it's probably good to have the merchant say something so um what are you buying um let's move that up so this will happen sometimes where you want to move something up. All you have to do is, um, I'm going to do control C because I'm going to use that again. Select the thing and if you hit control V, it'll paste it on top of it. So what are you buying? Shop processing. And then, hey, hey, thank you. Wow, great typing skills, Kai. And there you go. Now one last thing, my character doesn't have any money. Actually, let's add a chest while we're at it. Why not? Since we're we're already here. So quick event, treasure. And we're gonna change the treasure box to something that looks a little cooler. Sci-fi chest. Sure. Ooh, this one's cool. Alright, let's do that. So it's gonna give us five thousand gold. That should be enough. And that's it. Treasure chest done. Okay, let's play test this. All right, so talk to the merchant. What are you buying? And there we go. Oh no, what have I done? All right, let's get our money. $5,000 were found.
Definitely. All right. So now we have poop juice, and mm. that's how you make mm. that's how you make a shop. It's very very simple. Um, I don't really have homework for this one, but if you'd like to add more items to your shop and maybe do better, um, I'm gonna go ahead and remove that cow mooing sound effect because as funny as it was the first time, it's kind of done by now. But I hope you guys are enjoying these uh, tutorials. I hope they're not too <laughs> ridiculous. Um, oh God, where's, there we go. All right, much better, cool. So um, that's it for this one and let's move on to the next one.